back to the Philbin Files playing Pathfinder. Um, I'm your host, Ginker Philbin. I, um, let's see. I feel like I've been doing a little bit of work here. And I'm trying to remember what it was I was doing. Ah, yes. <clears throat> so, we need to do some stuff with these, which is requiring of some quartz, and then there was in Liberty here. There was also, is it this? Yes, this, this guy. Also, this guy needed something here. It was um, core, clockwork, core, compass, core, which is a gassed tier, which is made by blocks of quartz. So we're going to go up to the space station and then over to quartzite. Um, actually, I should be able to go straight there from here. But I'm going to get ready to go. I'm going to get, instead of waiting for so long for things to power up, I'm going to grab two of these. Um, and I'm going to... Yeah, we should just be able to... Yeah, just pop up over to Quartzite real quick. And pick up our... Uh, pick up a bunch of Quartz and continue on with there. So I will be right back when we get there. A recording. Well, the game did load... And it took us to, uh, took us to this place. If that's not a pile of quartz, I don't know what. Let's see. Desert hills. Hell. Ooh, hell over here. Desert. A little something there. Can I see what that is? Not really. That is over, over that way. So, um... Quartz. Quartz as far as the eye can see. I see a red sun. Is it moving? Or is that just the clouds? Doesn't look like it's really moving. We'll light the way here. We'll get our stuff set up. Um, I'm going to need... Okay, that's... Receiver's got power, so I need to do... Tiling device, that. And then I brought... Um, I want one for that probably, but we're probably good for now. So let's do 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 do. Got three of those. Put that out there. Dialing device, transmitter. <coughs> All right. One, two. Um. Yeah, we're gonna put one. Put one. Yeah, we'll put one here. No, not there. Dummy. Alright. Uh, transmitter goes there. Dialing device goes there. Generator goes there. You... Oh, you have no power. I should have charged that up before I left. Oh, well. You know what? Let's bring... You're okay. Oh, come on. Do do do. Let's bring you over here and triple up on. Ten. Hmm. Yeah. That ought to have that cranking up pretty fast. Um, you have no power. Did I bring any? No. Did I bring any cables? I did not bring any cables. Fluid duct. Alright, well once this is charged, we'll move this over and deal with that. Um, do, 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 do. Have you moved? Not so sure. Okay, so there's something out that way to the east. That's really the only feature. But we do have quartz. And the only thing is this worked out nicely. Look at this. Almost dare to... In fact, maybe I can use this to make a little bit of a safety net. Um, let me think about that and be right back. Um, the sun still hasn't moved, so I may something up there. Um, I may not actually ever need 
the little safe zone I've made here, I've got probably more quartz than I will ever need. Got some in here too. But I've got quartz as far as the eye can see. I'm going to go explore that real quick, quick while this charges up. Um, but I may not actually ever have to come back. So here, let's do. Well, let's just go see. 72% on the hover. Let's go see what this looks like. Just to see some something in this featureless land. This almost, if this is permanent daylight, and such a nice clean area, although it has jack for resources that we would actually need, I would think that this would be a great place for a base. Maybe. Oh, zombie pigmen. Hmm. Oh, and a st couple structures. Now, are they gonna? Are they gonna aggro me? I can get away from them pretty easily. Do do do. I don't think they care about me. Oh, interesting. There's a dark spot there, with a couple skeletons. Weird. What is that? Where am I on the map? Interesting. Okay, so the island up there is providing just the right amount of shade for zombie for for stuff to spawn there. Weird. Okay. Well. Interesting. Let's. No need to hang out here. We've got what we came for. Now we're just goofing around until we can go back. So when I get back and work on a few things, I'll I'll see you there. We made it back. Didn't blow up this time. Our final score was 30 stacks. We got 29 in there. We got one in our hand. 30 stacks of quartz blocks. And then it was the gas tier. We needed to do that, that, and it was... It was one of these bowls. Aha, a stone bowl. So now we've got a whole mess of gas to tears. And we can put one in here. We can put one in here and get... Oh, good lord. Alright, fine. You guys come here. Core. Core. Feather, flint, and steel. I'll bet you it doesn't like the fact that the flint and steel has been used. Bah. Um. Okay. So I have I have iron somewhere. I know I do. I've got two. Iron. 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 Wow. I need to go. I need to make an iron world next. I think. Um. Okay. Iron. No. Come on. You guys go back over here. Iron. It's my flint. No flint there. No flint there. No f stuff I was working on. Oh, hey, look, a reward bag that I grabbed. Storage scanner. Oh, that's right, I finished up all that stuff. <laughs> I should tell you about that. Storage scanner. All right. No freaking, 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 freaking. that down and get the got the bucket back how nice of them we got the celestial core down now I started clearing a space out up here I read that you plop it down and it will oh my oh interesting it, that's pretty cool what do you Okay, so the red sparkles are what it's complaining about. But it builds the whole thing. It, that's cool. Although it's weird that it complains about grass, I guess. But hey, who's going to be picky? Is it complaining about anything else? No, that's it. We... Lightning. 
we made a celestial compass. That's kind of cool. A heart, a squiggle, maybe a flame, moon, death, sun. No idea. Well, that's pretty cool. All right. Well, we'll figure out what to do with that. It says harvestable. I don't think I'm going to yank it up. Let's throw a couple of torches down around here. Feels like it's putting out a little bit of its own light, but... Oh, oh, hello. And our visitor is back. Go away. This, uh, this sledgehammer has turned out to be a pretty good... I don't want you. Pretty good thing for smacking zombies and skeletons and stuff. Um... Let me grab this reward bag. We made the storage scanner once we got the lapis, and in fact, I made a whole bunch of these machine frames. Creepers. I don't feel like messing with creepers. I don't want them blowing up my stuff. Um, and then we started working on this. We needed blaze powder to make the soul sand and some other stuff. Um, Maybe I'll go over that in a little more detail later, but let's go let's go up here and tell the storm passes. I don't feel like messing with those. And let's take a look at what we've got in our reward bag. Temperate fluid duck. Okay, well. I suppose that'll be handy at some point. <coughs> um, let's take a look at the quest book here. Do do do. Okay, uncompleted un Okay, so we made that. <sighs> it will begin forming a multi-block structure. Certain blocks. Block look for a sparkle. Okay, so we did that. Alright, cool. Claim that reward. And then the next thing is going to be Chronomancer's best friend, the hourglass, can use time to manipulate everything around the user. Hourglass, once crafted, can be thrown into any circle of the celestial compass to infuse it with that time. Each time has different effect. Okay, so those are the different symbols on the on the compass there. When an infused hourglass is thrown into the center, however, it will be emptied of all time within it. So you can put it in the middle to reset it. Um, okay, so it wants us to make one of these. Now, the other things we did, we were working on Whoop, no, come on. Ah, this. This. Open. We were working on... Was it these things? Seed infuser? It was the seed or the seed infuser? Yeah, okay. So we were working on the seed infuser, but it needed the seed, and the seed needed awkward potion which needs nether wart, which we haven't seen growing anywhere yet. But you can make it with nether quartz and a, and a seed. One of the Pam's harvest seeds, it looks like. So I think we do... Well, let's check this out real quick. Yay, hardened sar servo. I'm getting a lot of those. It's trying to hint us to something. I should probably grab something to eat. A couple apples. And it's dark out there. And the creeper has moved over there. Lovely. Yeah. Alright, well, let's grab a little bit of nether. Let's get a little, grab a quartz here. Because I think we can throw it in the grinder. Oh, let's take the zinc dust out, put that in, and see if we get... Yep, that's going to work. Okay. So that's what we're going to do next time. We're going to work on that the seed infuser and stuff and see about this whole growing... Um, growing iron and aluminum and stuff like that. Iron, iron, iron seed. So you take the seed in the seed infuser... 
yeah, I have no idea how this works. I'm going to have to look this up. But anyway, I think that'll do it. Nice short little episode. Uh, Quartzite turned out to be much better than anything I could have expected. If I make some more dimensions, maybe I can copy that one and then just replace the quartz with iron or something. I don't know. Anyway, um, that'll do it for this episode. I will see you next time. Well, I can see it at my window. Hello! You know what? Can I? Do I? I don't have any extra glass. Probably not. No. Probably not in here either. No. Oh well. I'm gonna have to make this a nice bay window so I can see my beautiful compass. Clockwork compass. Something, something. Anyway, see you next time on The Film Files. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.